Hello, forest friends. How y'all doing? I wanted to introduce my new friend. This here is Mr. Echo. I just got him yesterday, but we've already grown very close. We have a little bond. I called him Mr. Echo because if you've ever seen Lost, it's one of the most awesome shows ever. And he's got like a perfect M right on his head. It's kind of hard to see right now. But anyways, woo, there you go. Oh, what time it is. Well, if you read the title, you know what time it is. Bubba Birch Box. Bubba Birch Box. Bubba Birch Box. It's one of my favorite days of the month. Time for the Birch Box. Who are not familiar with Birch Box, it is a monthly subscription service. You can get four to five deluxe size beauty samples in each box, and it only costs you ten bucks a month. The super cool thing about Birchbox is not only can you refer friends to get points, but you can also review your products that you get in your box each month to save up points for things like this. This is a giant container of setting powder by Marcel. It is 2.4 ounces, and I got this for free just for reviewing products. I haven't referred anyone yet, but I just reviewed all the products that I got in the last one, two, three, four. This will be my fifth birch box. It only took me four birch boxes to accumulate enough points to get something this awesome. So definitely, if you do sign up, use my link. It'll give me points and you can do the same thing I'm doing. Spread the word about birch box and get free stuff of your own. Or like I said, just review your products. It's so easy. It's a really short little survey followed by a little comment section that you fill out. Just be honest, whether you liked it or not, tell the truth and it will do you good. I already opened the seals here. I haven't looked inside, but I didn't want to scrape the top of my birch box as I normally do because they're always really pretty and I use them to store my makeup and I don't want to destroy this one, so. We'll reveal it together. Oh, I don't think everyone got the same color. I'm not too sure. But this is super cute, as always. Pastel blue on the bottom. And I think that they have in the Birchbox shop Keds. I don't know if they're sold out or not. The shoes, the canvas shoes with this print on them. And they're actually really cute. I don't know if I could pull them off, but hey. If you're into that kind of thing, check them out. Alrighty, let's take this party outside, shall we? I live in Florida, so I always like to take the party outside, unless it's raining, and it's kind of rainy season, so it should be doing that soon. Oh, you guys can look. I'm not gonna. I want to be surprised. Bright yellow tissue paper, all sunny and awesome. I'm all about it. Okie doke. First, we have some, ooh, Vera Bradley Vanilla Sea Salt Eau de Toile. But once again, a standard size sample. Vanilla Sea Salt sounds very interesting to me. <laughs> Fresh Sea Air French Vanilla Lily of the Valley and Cotton Candy. The description sounds way fancier than the title let on. Let's see what this is all about. It's really cute. I wouldn't mind seeing that pattern on like some stationery or something. That actually smells really nice. My first thought was donuts, but I'm kind of... I don't know. The description explains it, but it doesn't do it justice. Smell-o-vision yet? Do we have it? Oh. It's super nice. It kind of smells like candy. It definitely smells edible sophisticated. I really like it. I'm down with some Vera Bradley fragrance. Hey, this is big. This is a beauty protector. Protect and detangle leave-in conditioner. Pretty good size sample. 
It's kind of hard to smell over the Vera Bradley right now, but it smells fresh and kind of fruity and really good. And it's interesting. This kind of feels like it has like a no slip grip on it. It's very interesting. Protector UV protector seals cuticle, soothes hair, locks in color, adds shine. It's weightless, non-greasy. It conditions. It's for all hair types and you can use it daily. And that's all it says. Next in the birch box. Another ginormous, whoa. This is like toothpaste size. This is huge. And I have really big hands, so wow. This is a Kopari coconut oil coconut crush scrub. Polish your skin to perfection and say hell yes to hydration. This brown sugar scrub is infused with small pieces of Tahitian coconut shell to buff dry stuff right off of your bod. So I thought this was going to be a facial product, but it's for my body. I'm really excited. It sounds freaking delicious, to be honest with you. I just kind of wanted to show you guys the texture of this stuff since it says it has coconut shell and brown sugar and all that fun stuff in it. It does smell delicious. It smells like it should be in form of a pixie stick and it would be amazing, but I'll let you see all of the texture in there. You can see the different things that it talked about. The coconut shell, the brown sugar, and you can tell there are some very hydrating oils in there as well. I really hope there's some makeup in here. Kula, I know this brand. This is a classic sunscreen SPF 50 for the face, sport, certified organic. White tea moisturizer plus plant protection, organic sun care. I need to go to Daytona or Flagler Beach soon, so hopefully I'll have an excuse to use this really soon. It smells a lot like your normal sunscreen, but with just a more sophisticated touch. Screen, it's nice. It's not greasy. It's not sticky. I like it. And I believe we've got one more thing in our birch box. Yes, one more. Ooh! This is a cargo eyeshadow or bronzer, one of the two. It is a cargo blush and bronzer duo. Yay! In the shade Catalina in medium. Mr. Echo, can you help me open this? Oh my gosh! Although it's really cute and small and convenient, it is really hard to open. See, yeah, you know I'm having a hard time. I really cannot open this pro oh now I got it of course yay finally so it's really really tiny you guys know my hands are huge but I mean I think I have a small enough brush that I got from like a bare mineral set a long time ago that I can use for this but let's go ahead and do a soul watchy swatchy Gonna go over that blush one more time. These are really pretty. Pretty pigmented, and I like the amount of sparkle in the bronzer and how the blush is really super matte. I think that with my really light skin tone, that this will work out perfectly. I wish I would have had this before I filmed today, to be honest with you. It was worth the struggle to open. I will let you guys see that one more time because it is just. 
Well, I'd say that this was a pretty good birch box this month. Me a little more skin and hair products than I would like to receive in my sub boxes. But just like last time, it's really nice quality stuff that I'm definitely going to use. I really like it. And the one cosmetic product they did send, I'm pretty in love with. So, as a matter of fact, I think this bronzer and maybe even this uh, blush might end up on my eyes at some point. I'm going to experiment and see what happens. But, uh, yeah, I'm loving it. If you get a birch box as well, let me know down below. Let me know what you got this month, what you loved, what you didn't love so much. Let me know if you're thinking about getting a birch box. Let me know if you get any other beauty subscriptions. Just holler at me. I love reading your comments and talking to you guys. You give me reason to do this. I love you guys so much, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!